very good afternoon, morning, evening, wherever you're watching this from. Welcome to this week's video. Today we're in Liverpool on a very cold December morning. Currently at the Albert Dock. Doing a long exposure of that. I don't know what building it is, but I'll find out. And then in the distance there you can just see the lava buildings through the fog. I'm just waiting. Put a bit of the fog to come through um, to mask some of the, uh, the building. I've just got a few Andel shots. Um, I am on the tripod now, as you can see. Um, I've no filter on or anything. I am using Olympus's built in live ND feature on the EM1 Mark III, which is the one I use. It's um, effective five stops. And it's giving me uh, currently the, the back of the screen. So it's F14, ISO 64, giving me six seconds. Uh, I've got to get another one of them and then I'm going to stick the ND filters on. Um, try and get it longer exposure. And then maybe we to the seafront. Well, there is a uh, shipping. I don't know which shipper is, but like I say, I'll find that out and put some of the pictures up on there about that. A few disclaimers, Olympus, DJI, Asus, Skylum um, has not asked me to make this video, all videos are my own and mine only. I haven't been influenced anyway. Uh, I do have uh, some exciting news though. Um, I don't know if you do follow him, but a guy named Gary Goff. I'll link his uh, channel in the description below. He's absolutely amazing. He's, he's literally phenomenal. Um, he's the reason I've got into the long exposure, the fine art, trying to do the fine art stuff and that. Uh, but I am absolutely buzzing. I've um, been speaking to him recently, and we'll be doing a collaboration together in the new year around January, February time. So please do look out for that. Like I said, I'm really excited about it, and I can't believe you know, a photographer, artist of his calibre, you know, he's willing to, you know, he's willing to work with me and that, and I just, I'm absolutely over the moon. Um, so just a big shout out to Gary, like I said, he's a, he's a belting fella. Um, and I'm, I just can't wait for that day, I'm really looking forward to it. Um, so yeah, back to today's video, like I said, I'm going to do some long exposures here. Um, actually at the Albert Dock side on the waterfront on the River Mersa and then some street photography, get the liver buildings in um, a couple of these buildings here um, and take it from there so I'll crack on with this now and I will catch you when I'm at the waterfront Hello, so I'm here down now at the River Mersa doing some long exposure uh, the fog is still lingering, it's lifting a little bit now, so I'm getting a bit more definition in the clouds. Um, I spin it around. I got this, uh, I'll put the link in the description. That's me. Remote shutter. And then comes with that. And I've got to say, Four pound from Ally, absolute steel and works an absolute charm. Can't fault it one bit. It's got a two second delay button on. Um, you can see there, so that's your two second delay button, and then that then press obviously once get the single shot, press and hold and wing in bull mode, doing your long exposures, um, and then press it again to finish. Uh, it's Iod Lan Pebble Transmitter it is. Um, fantastic. Really, really <laughs> pleased with it. So yeah, I've got a few of the of the live buildings as you can just see through that gap there. Uh, earlier on there was a lot of fog coming through and it was like going halfway down 
the bit but you could still see the bird at the back I'm now here against the chain link fence looking over the river Merza uh, so I've got that in uh, there's the seaport and I've just missed a ship going out so I was a little bit gutted on that but I was taking some pictures over the the dock um, so yeah like I said the back of the screen I'll show you now so that's the composition I've gone for so I framed up with the love box in the, the seaport at the back and you can see the sea terminal there with a bit of the river Merza uh, getting a good two minute exposure I'm gonna try that so like I said so you're using this absolutely fantastic you just turn one to get your horizon level thing uh, level um, turn this one that turns it from left to right that one lever there and then this lever here is up and down but you can as you can see you can get it so precise it's also got two leveling gauges on the back as well um, that's a Borneo uh, tripod three way head absolute fantastic I'll spin you around there's a little uh, ferry there going past as you can see actually it looks like the waters are going out a little bit here but yeah, so beautiful there. Not as cold as it was earlier on, which is nice. So I'm enjoying myself here, just taking like say, some long exposures, um, using the inbuilt, uh, what do you call it? I can't think what it's called now. Just give me a sec. Focus practicing, that's it. Um, I'm going to have a bash at that now, see if I've tried out the inbuilt on that. Um, so, yeah, I'll put all the pictures up at the end. Um, I'm like I said, I'm going to carry on, I'm going to make my way a little bit further around, see if there's anything of interest that way. If you can see. I think I might actually go into the Albert Dock Bay. Um, there's a few nice boats in there and a few little sailboats. I think I might go that way or I might go down and get some. No, I'll go into the Albert Dock area and, and get some pictures there. So I will uh, crack on here and I'll catch you in a bit. Thank you for watching uh, this video. Coming from Liverpool, I'm hoping to get another one, maybe two, out before Christmas. Um, if I don't, I'd like to wish you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Wherever you're watching this from, stay safe and 
have a fantastic Christmas. And I, once again, the lights are thank you for watching. Peace. Out.